Hi everyone, Hannah here. Welcome back to the channel. For anyone that's new, welcome. My name is Hannah. I love all things Disneyland, Fly Star Wars, Harry Potter, so please do consider liking and subscribing. I've got a real fun unboxing today. Two lounge fly backpacks and some goodies that I've been sent. Very excited. Now, the first lounge fly backpack, I'm actually shocked that it was here already. I haven't taken it out of the box. I have been very restrained. Now, you can probably tell from the tape, it's from Geek Core. Friday, just gone, they released a Sleeping Beauty. Now one backpack, you will have seen from the thumbnail, one is Sleeping Beauty, one is Tangled. So I've done a bit of a mishmash today. So this backpack was released, was it 10am Friday morning? And it sold out quite quickly actually, so I'm very glad that I got one. It arrived Saturday. And it was normal shipping as well. I believe shipping is free when you spend over either 50 or £60. So it's already here. I'm very excited. I have been so restrained not to get out of the box already, just saying. Like I've already said, Sleeping Beauty theme. Yes, I did cut that bit. Yeah. Oh, yes, I cut that bit as well. Even though I've got a box opener now, I'm not great with this. Did that cut? Yes. Right, we will put that there first. Now, I didn't look, or oh, packing slip, I didn't look at pictures online, I just bought it. Because I, if I know I'm going to get a backpack, I don't like to look at all the pictures. I want to know myself if there's an inside pocket, that sort of thing, what the inner lining is. So I don't look at all the pictures. Oh, there we go. There's a little thank you. I will link Geek Core down below. By the way, if you want to go and have a look, yeet that over there. Oh, this is different wrapping. Oh, my word. Okay. Excuse one second. Chuck the box over there. Wrapping. Okay. What are these bits? Okay. We'll get her out. Sorry if this bit's a bit noisy. We'll get her out. She glitters. She glitters all the card. Oh, it's one big bit of card for the back and the bottom. The straps are down. That bugs me a bit, but that's fine. I have... I use... I don't want to turn any of these around. I've got like chunky thick material cable ties that I use for the straps when I've used them. I haven't got any used ones around me with them. Oh, I've got that one, but then there's, there's stuff. Um, I'll link those down, those down below as well. They're just like a material cable tie that secure the straps up like that, which just makes them easier to display. Anyway, holy moly, she's beautiful. And she glitters. She... Okay. Here we go. Is there a price on this one? There's not. I believe she was... Ooh. She was either $74.99 or $79.99. One of those two. Look at these sequins. I mean, if you've seen my videos before, I love a sequin backpack. But it's, it's like a... Sorry. Blah, blah, blah. Get my words out. It's a beautiful mix of like pink and like silver sequins. So it's not just like all pink, like this one is, for example. It's like a mixture of pink and silver sequins. Just look at them sparkle. They are beautiful. And we have Flora, one of the three good fairies. So this one's Flora. Then we have Fauna, who's green, and Merryweather, who is the blue fairy. And they're doing the make it pink, make it blue, make it blue. Do you reckon they would do a blue one of this? Well, like make it pink, make it blue. So you could have this, but where it's pink, make it blue. Someone please make that one. I will buy it. It's beautiful. And then we have Sleeping Beauty Castle up here. This, oh, that's probably why there was extra card in there, just to keep that bit nice and safe. It's stunning. So there's Sleeping Beauty Castle, and then there's beautiful roses there as well. Look at that detail. And that castle. That goes all the way up top just there. And there's some of these bits that are debossed in. Not embossed. Debossed in. They're so nice. And they're like, I think they've been painted as well. There's some bits that are gold and there's some bits that are silver. I might need to hold that up real close for those bits. Like some of them are gold and some are silver. But then the rest, is it all the way around the rest? It is. All of these bits around 
glitter they shimmer i think it it's not like glitter on the top that will come off it's like an inbuilt shimmer into the material so you shouldn't need to, no none of that's coming off so it looks like that's all like fully inbuilt into the material so it's not gonna you're not gonna suddenly see glitter falling everywhere which would not be great the bottom does the bottom shimmer no it doesn't i thought the bottom shimmered then the bottom is just like a nice pink color but then look at this if i show the side and the kind of side to side a bit hopefully you can see that shimmer in a way and it's the same all over the top as well and then whoops don't drop it and then onto this side with that shimmer and the back if i move the tag it has the spinning wheel where she pricks her finger does that also it does have some debossed parts on there as well with the roses and the spindle I love it there's that spinning wheel at the back and the back also shimmers I love this even more how to make a lounge fly amazing sequins and shimmer all you need not even then I mean some of them that don't have sequins on are just as amazing but if you want it to be fancy shimmer and sequin so i'm going to do a 360 and then we'll have a look on the inside because like i said when i'm gonna get a backpack i don't look online at what the lining is or if there isn't in a pocket i would rather see that for myself but yeah like i said with the straps i am gonna i'm gonna grab one let's just do it move some of these bits and bobs i know i've used this one and this should have the ties on the back there we go just like material cable ties to keep the straps nice because otherwise it does get a bit annoying I mean, each to their own. So I've seen some people display them with the straps down. I just prefer it when they're kind of neat and away. And they don't get in the way. So, did it... Yes, I'm going to do another 360 just because she's so beautiful. She is beyond gorgeous. I love it. And this one has the badge down there. For the most part, they either have the badge down there or up in the middle. I have... Oh... I can't think of them to hand, but there are a couple that I've got where the badge is like on the side pocket as well, so that it can be on the side pocket. That also works. Oh, there's a bit of dust with that. Yes, yes. Bit of dust. She has it in a pocket, and it's a zip in a pocket. This is why I don't look online because I like to see that part in person for myself. I love it. This is a beautiful inner lining, by the way. It's like it's a little bit lighter than this pink colour, more of like a baby pink. And it's got Aurora there, it's got Aurora's crown. Is that a squirrel? I think there's a little squirrel in there, in like a fancy pattern. If I show you that part first, and then you can see the inner pocket in there as well. Which has a zip, by the way. She has a zip in a pocket. And I'll show it that way. That will be the same lining in the front pocket as well. They will have the same. And she has the side pockets. Oh, there we go. If I push that in, now the packing's out. Little slip side pockets that have that same lining in there. I tend to put, when I have these slip-ons, just like a small bottle of hand sanitizer, just slips nicely in there. Like, I never put anything important in there, because obviously it's easily accessible. I mean, I would have the Sleeping Beauty ears on for an outfit, but they work perfectly together. I love this one. Righto, really quickly. Oh, get my hair out of the way. Before the Tangled Lounge Fly, I have bought and been sent a couple of goodies from JJ Customs, who I will link down below. The bits that I bought are... I've got to think, I've always loved Vampire Diaries, but ever since I met Paul Wesley, who plays Stefan Salvatore, it's kind of reinvigorated it, and at the Telford Comic Con, which I'm going to in a couple of weeks, I'm going to be meeting Daniel from Originals, who played Elijah. Who's one of my favourites. So I've got a pack of Damon Salvatore stickers, and they're kind of just all different cutouts of Damon Salvatore, and a keychain of the Originals. If you've not seen the Originals, it's kind of like a spin-off from Vampire Diaries, and it's about the original family. So Rebecca, Klaus and Elijah on there. And she's done a new Disney range. So I bought these ones for myself. And she very kindly sent me these goodies. Now the one I'm going to start with. 
I love it that much. It's already on my phone. She sent me a phone case because she's now doing Disney phone case. She does like original and Vampire Diaries and Harry Potter as well, but she's doing the Disney range. Look at this. It's just beautiful. And it actually feels really nice as well. And it matches my aerial stuff. It matches. If red hair wasn't so difficult to maintain, I would probably have red hair for a bit. I had red hair in the past. But anyway, so Ariel Case, she does obviously different phone sizes, different princesses. I've seen an Aurora one, there's a mini one. I'm sure she's done a Mickey Waffle stuff as well. I'm sure there's Mickey Waffles. Because how to make waffles better? You make them Mickey shaped. And then, look at this. This beautiful mini bookmark. And it's like, it's solid as well. It's not like an easy paper one that's going to bend or get gacky if you get it a bit wet. There's this beautiful mini. It's so nice. Actually, that could display next to that. I'm going to put that there for now. With red. With red sequin. She can go there, can't she? And then we have a jasmine keychain. Look at that. There is seen my videos before i'm after i'm pointing at them there's none in shot the princess sequin series that's the bane of my life right now jasmine's on her way to me so she is going to stay with jasmine when she arrives and they're again really substantial keychain so if i show the side they're like really nice and thick and substantial and she sent me a mug as well oh. Here we go and it came with like a mug care sheet oh and 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 calm down a sticker that says queen of naps sleeping beauty appropriate outfit sleeping beauty so that sticker might have to go next to that backpack won't it i will pop like i said i will pop all of her information down below and the link and she's put me a lovely message on the back of there so thank you very much jess look at this sleeping beauty mug which goes perfectly with that new backpack by the way with flora fauna and merryweather up the top and the bottom and it is kind of it's like double-sided it's got the same design front and back because that way if you hold it in that hand you can still see the design and so can others depending how you hold it how do you hold okay i am right-handed but i wear my watch on the right and i use my fork when i'm eating in the right hand as well apparently that and the fork in the right hand is a left-handed thing and i also drink how do i drink now no i drink with it in my left hand oh i don't know i've just confused myself but apparently i do things left-handedly even though i write with my right hand maybe i'm ambidextrous but anyway look at this together oh look at those two oh excuse me she's just clinked tea time how beautiful i'm not holding that very well am i one second how beautiful are they together? Oh, do you know what? I might have to display them together. I'm going to redo this section at some point and I want like a massive princess section so I can have like this. Actually, this is Sleeping Beauty Castle, isn't it? Perfect. I didn't plan that, by the way. Right, let me just move these couple of bits there. Get my hair out of the way for the Rapunzel. Rapunzel Lounge Flight, which, why are these ears falling? I'm all over the place today. Uh, apologies, can you tell I'm a bit all over the place? Anywho, I have a new Tangled Lounge Fly. I'm already obsessed. I haven't gotten it out of the packaging either. I've been very good. I did get it out of the box, but I haven't got it out of the packaging. And I'm loving that. Bit. I might just actually keep that there. Like, that's your home now. You can stay there. Scissors! Right. Where's the tape? Yoink! In there. Right, I'm going to put those down because we don't want to be silly with scissors. Even though I might need it again. Yes, I do need it again. For the paper. Oh, oh. Oh, goodness me, there's a lot of tape on the paper. I don't understand this. Sometimes you won't get any tape on the paper, and then sometimes you'll get like a bum load of tape on the paper. I don't understand my word are we done we're done we can put the scissors away right you got there 
card out the back. Now I have seen this backpack in Forbidden Planet before, so I kind of already know what it's gonna look like. But then having my own one in person and I can properly look at it. Oh no, this bit's stuck. Oh goodness me. Oh look. Oh there's a bit of plastic on the label. Get off. That's a future Hannah problem. It's the Tangled Scenes backpack. Tangled is one of my favourite films ever. It really is. We love like Spirit Elsa and Sorcerer Mickey are my favourite characters. Tangled and Little Mermaid are two of my favourite films. Although I love Frozen too, but Spirit Elsa. But me and my husband love this scene in particular. Just <laughs> it's one of those that it's kind of in a way to kind of become like our song we just whenever that comes on we're both just like oh ain't it nice but anyway less of that more of the backpack so because it's from the scenes collection it's covered in scenes like it's not just one scene it's loads of them so the very top there you've got rapunzel and flynn and that's when it's the i see the light song and it's like the when they're in the boat and it's just beautiful with the lanterns and then on the top of the pocket here, it's Rapunzel, where Mother Gothel, she's been a bit nasty to her, isn't she? Right there, Gothel and Rapunzel. You can't really see that part massively well, but it's just like a nice detail. Pascal. You have to have Pascal as the zip puller. Look at his face. And then the front part is Rapunzel when she's finally leaving the tower and she's got the frying pan with her. Look at that. I'm trying to get my Rapunzel hair back. I'm trying to grow it as much as I can. And we've got the Disney Lounge Fly badge at the bottom corner just there. This pocket has Maximus. Look at his face. He's like, what the heck? That's probably the PG version of what he's thinking. <laughs> and then around the top, it's like some of the artwork that she draws. So kind of where she draws around the tower there and there. And then you can see just there is Pascal again. Look at his face. He's so sweet. What's the bottom? The bottom's just like a plain purple colour, which is the same purple that's kind of used for the straps and the, the straps. This kind of part around the zips and the straps. Excuse me. The back. Now, the back of these ones have had the villains on them. Although, did the Sleeping Beauty one have Maleficent on the back, or did that have Sleeping Beauty and Prince Philip? dancing on the back or have I thought of another one I might have to double check that one but Mother Gothel is on the back of this one she is a good villain I'll give her that there she is in all her glory when she's looking young because she's taken Rapunzel hostage I'm not going to sing the song because I can't sing and we don't want it to rain so I'm going to do 360 I'm going to do it a little bit slow because there's so much detail on this one like I feel like I could sit here all day looking at this backpack and still miss things there's just so much detail and I really do like the scenes one because it's not just Gothel again like it's not just the one scene on there you get so many scenes from the film on the same backpack and they've started doing these for Star Wars as well I love it a little Pascal as a zip puller so sweet. I have, where's the little mermaid one? where have I put that one? that one's down in that corner I was going to grab it but it's down there Oh my goodness me! Oh, I got there eventually. This is jam packed full of packaging. Oh my goodness. Oh! Oh! She has an inner pocket. She has an inner pocket. This one is just a slip in a pocket. But it's an inner pocket, nonetheless. Oh my word. What on earth is going on there? That's different paper. Anyway, details. Oh, that's the rest of it. Ooh, this is an unexpected inner lining. How on earth am I going to describe this? It's almost like a heart, but with a circle on the inside of the heart with Rapunzel there, and then the tangled flower, the tangled sun, her tiara. Is that a paintbrush? And a paintbrush. And it's like a pink colour, and the details are purple. Hopefully, there we go. I hope I've described that well enough. <laughs> or I've just butchered that. There we go. 
and that slip in a pocket and again that will be the same design on the front pocket as well oh, I love it. I'm gonna do one more 360 just because like I said there's so much detail on this one and it's just beautiful so beautiful I think these ones for the scenes collections retailed for about 74 99 another massive thank you to Jess from JJ customs for sending me these goodies I'm gonna start using this one soon like where's my phone gone now I've already started using this amazing phone case because it's just so beautiful and I love Ariel and it acts see if I wasn't using the phone case I would display it there but it's too good not to use so let me know what your favorite was from today thank you all so much for watching don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video bye